if a robot that can run and do backflips costs less than a used car? With the Unitree R1, that fantasy is now a reality. This robot drops the average price of a full-size humanoid by over 90% and makes advanced robotics accessible to a much wider audience. This is the Unitree R1. And the most shocking thing about it? The price! At just $5,900, it's a true game changer. This marks a seismic shift. For the first time, a full-size, impressively capable humanoid robot is legitimately within reach of the general public. From labs and elite industry players who've traditionally commanded price tags of $16,000, Unitree G1, to upwards of $90,000, H1, to everyday innovators, the R1 opens the door to real-world, hands-on robotics at a consumer-friendly price. What does that mean for us, the general public? It means that for the first time, a full-size, incredibly capable humanoid robot is something that's actually within reach for a lot more people. Think about it. For the price of a pretty decent used car, you could get a robot that can do a handstand. That's wild, right? So in this video, let's look into everything that makes the Unitree R1 so special. We'll look at what it can do, what its limitations are, and how it stacks up against the big players in the robot world. First off, let's get to the good stuff. The R1 is a little over four feet tall and weighs about 55 pounds. But don't let that fool you. This robot is all about movement. Unitree, the company that makes it, has a reputation for building some of the most agile robots out there. And the R1 is no different. It has 26 joints, or what the tech world calls degrees of freedom. That's a lot of joints. And it lets the R1 pull off some truly incredible moves. You've probably seen the videos online of it running, doing flips, and even busting out some martial arts style kicks. The robot can correct its own balance in real time, which is a super difficult thing to do. So, if it gets nudged or pushed, it can usually stay on its feet. But it's not just about acrobatics. The R1 also has a brain, a real one. It has an onboard AI that uses a large language model. That's a fancy way of saying it can understand what you're saying and respond. It also has cameras and sensors, so it can see things and figure out what they are. It can detect faces, recognize objects, and even respond to gestures. So it's not just a fancy toy that can do tricks. It's a platform that can interact with the world around it. It can hear you, see you, and understand what you're trying to do. That's the real magic here. It's a robot that's designed to be a companion, an assistant, or a buddy for us humans. What kind of things would you want your robot companion to do? Now, the price is what really makes this robot stand out. When you hear about humanoid robots, you usually hear about companies like Tesla, Agility Robotics, or Boston Dynamics. But those robots are in a completely different league when it comes to cost. Take Tesla's Optimus, for example. It's not even commercially available yet, but experts think it will probably cost somewhere between $20,000 and $30,000. That's a huge difference from the R1's $6,000. And a robot like Agility Robotics Digit? That one is aimed at industrial use and costs around $100,000. Then there's Boston Dynamics Atlas, the one that does all the crazy parkour. That's a research robot only and is estimated to cost well over a million dollars. So the R1 is not trying to compete with these giants on every single feature. It's playing a different game. Unitree's main strategy is to make a super agile, affordable robot that anyone can use to learn about robotics, program new things, and just have fun with. The R1 is a movement-first robot. Its main thing is how well it can move. The other big-name robots are often focused on things like carrying heavy boxes in a warehouse or doing very precise, delicate tasks. The R1 is more like an athlete or a dancer, its whole design is built around fluid, dynamic movements, and it's a platform for everyone. The R1 comes with an open SDK, which is basically a set of tools and code that lets you build your own programs for the robot. If you're a student, a researcher, or just someone who loves to tinker, this is huge. It means you can go in and program the R1 to do whatever you want. Now, let's be real. 
At that price, there have to be some trade-offs, right? Absolutely. The R1 is an amazing piece of tech, but it's not perfect. And it's important to understand what it can't do, especially compared to the super expensive robots. One of the biggest things it lacks is hands. The standard R1 model has these fixed, not so useful hands. If you want to actually pick things up and manipulate them, you have to buy the educational version, which comes with functional hands. And that costs extra. So the R1 is not going to be washing your dishes or folding your laundry right out of the box. Another limitation is the battery life. The R1 can only run for about one hour on a single charge. This is fine for a quick demo or a learning session, but it's not enough for a full day of work in a warehouse or around the house. It's a trade-off they made to keep the weight down and the price low. A lot of the more expensive robots have systems that let you quickly swap out the battery, but the R1 doesn't have that. And while it has some autonomy, like understanding voice commands and seeing things, the base model is mostly remote controlled. If you want it to be fully autonomous, you have to do some extra programming yourself using the Open SDK. Again, this is a feature that makes it more of a tool for learning and development rather than a ready-to-go home assistant. So with all that in mind, who is the Unitree R1 actually for? It's not trying to be the perfect home robot butler just yet. Instead, Unitree is positioning it as a tool for a specific audience. It's perfect for university labs and research teams that want to study human-robot interaction without spending a million dollars on a robot. It's also great for robotics and AI classes in schools. A robot this affordable means a whole classroom can get hands-on experience, not just watch a video of one. Unitree's R1 isn't just for developers or content creators. It's for anyone excited about the future of robotics, signaling that these incredible machines are becoming accessible to all. It captures the spirit of the personal computer revolution. Not flawless yet, but affordable enough to inspire a technological movement. As a blank canvas for innovators and dreamers, it's ready to be programmed, customized, and explored. Does an affordable robot like this get you excited? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this look at the Unitree R1, make sure to like and subscribe for more content about the latest in technology and robotics.